A Grand Rapids man has been sentenced to prison for his role in a deadly overdose that took place in Walker a little more than a year ago. And as 13 on your side's John Hogan explains, it is something that has become all too familiar. It's like a roulette wheel. And uh, this is not the first case I've had of this nature. Like a roulette wheel. In his last week on the bench, Kent County Circuit Court Judge Paul Sullivan sentenced Keontae Bowman to prison for delivery of a controlled substance causing death. Bowman got a minimum of about six years. The judge set the maximum at 25 years. Under the circumstances of this case, and the information contained in the report, I believe that a sentence uh, the higher in the guidelines as agreed to or is appropriate. Bowman was to report to jail on Monday. The incident happened at a motel in Walker on New Year's Eve in 2019. Police say Bowman delivered a dose of fentanyl to 39-year-old Zachary Andrew Murray, resulting in Murray's death. Bowman entered a plea to the charge last year. He had been facing up to life in prison. Opioids play a role in many of the overdose deaths here in Kent County. It's a trend Kent County Medical Examiner Dr. Stephen Cole says continues. Fentanyl is probably our single most common and problematic drug. Uh, oftentimes we will uh, identify that in the drug screen along with heroin or heroin metabolites. Fentanyl played a role in 64% of Kent County's 109 fatal overdoses in 2019. Cole says overdoses for 2020 are expected to be higher. I think our drug overdoses have increased in the last year because of COVID. At least five people were prosecuted in Kent County in the last year for delivery of a controlled substance causing death. This is happening more and more and people are dying as a result of this uh, trafficking and, and narcotics even on an incidental basis. In Walker, John Hogan, 13 on your side.